work? Oh, wait, no. Wait. Turn your shit on, brother. I think it works. I think this works. I think this works. Okay, it works. <laughs> and welcome back to the channel. I'm Ethan. And I'm Brandon. It's been a while since we posted anything, but that's okay. We're shoving these down the pipe. <laughs> So, um, yeah, this was Mind Games two years ago. Yeah. August 31st that we posted this. Interesting story about this movie. It was made in one day. Probably like five hours. Yeah, about five yeah. hours. And it gets cringier towards the end because that's when my parents started coming home. <laughs> so some of those extra scenes were like, okay, like, real snappy. Like, yeah. all right, let's, let's go. So it, without further ado, let's get into it. We're breaking down this movie. We're reacting to it. A little bit of commentary. Okay. What is very interesting is uh, we actually added music and yeah, we right. yeah we added music. Tracks. Yeah, we made a title card. Yes. Man, that's uh, that's a shame. Uh, this girl I've been dating for the last two weeks. Again, two audio's weeks. not yeah, quite man. as crisp. So I think the video looks a little bit yeah, better. It's really serious. bright in there, though. You know, she uh, wouldn't answer my calls and texts, and then I was getting worried, so I went over to her house. You went over to her house? Yeah, I was worried. <laughs> and I was, she, I, she played dumb. I like she didn't even know me. She's like, I, sir, I've never met you before in my life. And I was like, what? <laughs> you trying to fucking lose? Yeah, try not to oh, lose man. it there. Two years ago. I know, right? Like, August. And, uh, get your mind off of you're right. You're right. Let's go. Is this before COVID or in the middle of it? Right after. So in the middle of it. Yeah, in the middle of it. Let's do an action movie. Right. A little universe meta. Ooh. I think with most of our Sweet movies, we're going to try to tie them together somehow. Like the B and E U. Ooh, that's the, like the B and E universe. Oh, <laughs> that is that is mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that is the goal, though. We want everything to kind of tie into each other. You're trying not to laugh. Because <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's the sweet place to die. Because we own the rights to it, so <laughs> can't get copyrighted on our own thing. You know, a lot of people say, "Do you shave your legs?" I tell them no. But now that I look at my own legs on camera, I, I, I see what I see what I ask that. <laughs> it's why the hell of it. I don't know why everything's so bright. I feel like we could have turned that contrast. I, I, I just think your house is bright. Yeah, that is true. <laughs> you think I got some good lights. So fun fact, uh, I was in a professional organization and they had a movie night and they played this and A Sweet Place to Die. Did oh. everybody love it or what? Yeah, everybody loved it, but it also was just like, man, here, here I am in a, in a Halloween mask, stroking the couch. Oh. <laughs> it just me and the eyes out of my way. You know what was funny too about filming this whole movie is at the beginning is we dedicated names. It was like, okay, you're like Richard or Randy yeah, yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we used it for like two minutes and then we completely forgot the oh, rest yeah. of it. See, this is one part though. Is later on in the movie I've discovered how to fish eye the camera so uh -huh. it really brings it back out. I didn't do that in this scene. See the nice subtle cue like in the that's good. You look like you got something to say, Brandon. No, I was trying to, I must, that shirt I don't have that shirt anymore. I was pretty sad, but at the same time you can still see the you had, you had to open the door a little bit to hit the light, right? Because there's like there's like a glimpse of light coming in. No, oh, well there's a door right here with the glass thing. <laughs> see my skin and <laughs> you know I thought for okay so yeah like I said we filmed this in about five hours just on the premise of like hey let's make a more horror movie okay what can we do 
And then this is what we came up with. This was like our little challenge. Oh, plumber. <laughs> I'll call you. I'll call you. <laughs> Yeah, hey Ethan. Yeah, man. Uh, when you're getting home, because the lights just went out. I think we're probably gonna call a plumber for that. <laughs> oh, yeah, electrician. Yeah, yeah, it's that too. It's kind of whatever. But uh, you yeah, have uh, <laughs> some weird stuff that's been going on lately. Like some weird stuff. But uh, yeah, man, make it home fast because um, I don't know what the heck's going on. All right, later. <laughs> oh, well. Eh, whatever. And there was no other camera person. It was literally just me <laughs> and the <a> tripod. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure you actually had the washcloth. I think, oh no, we just put stuff in there. No, yeah, we just put stuff in there. I, say, I'm sure, I'm swear you had the washcloth. <laughs> me and some joggers and a butt. <laughs> that is me, by the way. In the thing. Again, this could have been framed better. <laughs> I love your face right there. I don't know why. <laughs> oh my, my gloves, you can see all the, you know, skin breaks, I guess. Are you still? Yeah, okay. Dude, what? Dude, there's like something around here. I don't know. Like the and I don't know if anybody picked up on this, but my shirt and my mask, you know. Oh, on, they're like the uh, and still moving and then zombie now, undead. Like or like skull. Skull. There you go. Yeah. So, <laughs> I couldn't think of fucking the word skull. Again, another scene. Turn to your back. Titans are quiet. Dude, what are you talking about? Come on. Yeah. See, Brandon, there's nothing out here. Dude, I promise you. I saw something. This looks like a bad setup. Are you sure about that? I'm not crazy. Well, alright, then. So, why don't you, you sure about describe that? to me what you think you saw? I mean, it was all black. Had a oh, this is the fish eye look you were talking about, right? Yeah, I'm like, or it's wider. Yeah, I'm like, damn, I could be everything now. Are you sure you're drinking enough water? Are you eating enough? We had to cut the scene. Uh, why don't you just, uh, oh relax man. A bit, see if anything else pops up. I know you're trying to <laughs> give shout outs to uh, <laughs> The Last of Us 2. I was playing that at sure the time. I mean, man, that game's two years old already. That game. Oh, damn, we need to talk about that. I'll just relax. When I see this, I think of that meme where it's like, boys are just comfortable enough to live like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up? Oh, the audio's jacked up yeah. here, too. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> cool. Uh, he definitely For some reason, it like cut in the, the original video, so I had to go back over and dub it. Air mattress. I know, and the plastic sheet next to it is we just got a new mattress. Yeah. So that was like the, the protective covering around yeah. it. We just threw it to the side. Hey, man. I, just, I take up a, a lot of space on the bed. That's only like a full, I think. <laughs> I know, and it was funny because it was like, yeah, we'll like time lapse this or something. Like that. And we did. We just stuck it in there. We just stuck a raw clip in there. It's a big ass mass, bro. <laughs> we could have done this in so many better ways. <laughs> that's good, that's good. This is the purpose of that. To, to see 
one, how we can improve and how we improve. At least we added music, you know, and like we're still like, yeah, there's some parts where like the angles aren't filmed right, but. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what well, would have been realistic is me like. Dude, there's something right here. Like take my head. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> I swear, there's something right Close the door because my parents are home. There's nothing here. You sure it just wasn't under the plastic. No, man. It was looking right at me. I, See, I could have been like under the bed or something. Really yeah. Actually, that's a nice oh, blue. Well, I, like blue. Oh, I think we painted it. <laughs> Damn. Stretch out or maybe try to go back to sleep. And... <laughs> I don't know, man. Just, oh. Need to stretch out. <laughs> oh, well. Now, well. Listen, if you need me, I'll be in the other room. I think he tried. I think he tried to grab the knob, doorknob, and he missed. So he just can't lay it off. See, this is where it was too. Where we were trying to make it like a. Uh, what's the word? There is an Easter egg. Or there's a hat that has the logo of the ice cream company in the other movies. I think I'm gonna get off. I can okay. hear you breathing or like. <sighs> or I think you're. So. No, your fans are on because you'd be able to see so the shadow. You up tomorrow or something and see if we play again. What is that? I think your fan is on. Okay, no, it's not the fan. <laughs> it ain't me fucking breathing, I think. <laughs> yeah, damn. <laughs> Glad you're doing your right hand at your left Funny hand. Funny story answer. here is this whole panel fell off my wall in the middle of the night. <laughs> Scared the hell out of me. Hey, um, it's Ethan. So that it's is no longer there. Brandon's roommate. Look, uh, he's been actually oh, yeah, yeah. pretty weird. <laughs> <though>. <laughs> I was like, dude, why is this out there? He had to do this one, too. Damn. I did have to do this one, too. I was like, bro, why didn't you just remove my phone call? And I was like, all right. Thanks. And that's your phone. Does the match up what you say? No. <laughs> I did my best. See, yeah, see, now my dad's home. His big ass lunchbox. <laughs> <laughs> see my Under Armour logo? <laughs> Man, this, this demon sponsored. <laughs> I had enough of you. See, this is why he's all quiet when he says that, because everybody's home. Had enough of you. <laughs> no, it's funny. This was so hard to film with just two of us. Because it was me with my camera. Oh. <laughs> you ever like pick a pick the dog up and like let it on the back? You're just like, that is funny how you looked. Oh shit. Fall asleep. Got comfortable. <laughs> tired. Who's that tired? <laughs> After strangling someone. No. What have I done? <laughs> this is way too loud. <laughs> I put this this audio clip in. And it was way too loud. See me breathing. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure my arm changed position there too. Hey Ethan, I'm sorry I missed your call, but yeah, Brennan has been acting strange. That's why I broke up with him. He's been <laughs> serious and been really aggressive. He came by the house and yelled at me the other day and then he ran away. I would stay away from him. He's totally dangerous. Totally dangerous. This is the voice of my wife, Brittany. Damn, look, if you had like the credits rolling, as she, as she like, did the voice on that, but that was so like, but he's like, mm. yeah, that's so cool. Well. That's another uh, video reviewed, done, critiqued. A lot shorter. We had a lot of fun with this one. It was a good little project. I think because it's a shorter film, we had more fun because it's like trying to like trying to make something like 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 Sweet Place to Die thirty five minutes long. It's a lot. It takes a lot more energy and preparation to make a video like that than a thirteen minute video. You yeah, know? like that was hours of planning, mm -hmm. hours of film that yeah. we had to cut down and make sense. Yeah, and it still didn't really. Make sense. <laughs> we had fun doing it, but this I feel like 
one you and me just one really one, one set yeah and just just us and then just our imaginations whatever we could bring up come up with and i feel like it's not it's not on par with a sweet place to die with with like having fun with it and planning stuff like that but with like the amount of like ideas that we threw around while we're just like all right we'll film this real quick and then we would cut all right let's look at that all right so what else do you think could happen after this oh we do this this and that and then just go right into it again done in like five hours it was a very organic yeah very um spontaneous just mm-hmm. jump right in and go very improv more i probably said it's probably more improv than oh yeah way more improv than um sweet place to die yeah because like you said it was very like okay cool we just got this scene what next yeah all right let's do this and well, I don't think we took a break. We just kept I think, I think we literally just... Yeah. We talked it out as we went. It's like, okay, this makes sense because of this. We're mm-hmm. going to keep going. And I like that linear fashion because when we were filming A Sweet Place to Die... We were trying to, We were more focused on Sweet Place to Die 2 before we were even finished with Sweet Place to yeah, Die. Yeah, I was kind of like, okay, so how do we set this up? Mm-hmm. And really, and we didn't talk about this on the Sweet Place to Die one, but... That ending was not the original ending. Yeah, we, we touched on that. Yeah. How it was supposed to be like a Mexican standoff with mm-hmm. Brandon and everybody, and then he would shoot somebody. We didn't know who, and then it would, that would open up the next one. And then it would be like, well, that made no sense. And then we really just ran into the time constraints. Yeah. We just had to wrap we, it up. We just had to wrap it up because everybody was leaving. They were, you know, they all my actors were high school seniors. And then by the time we finished, it was like right around graduation. So everybody was leaving or going off and doing their own thing. For us, yeah, good point. Yeah. Um, with A Sweet Place to Die, that last boat scene was very impromptu. Mm-hmm. It was like, cool, how can we make an ending that makes sense? Because that the all the stuff on the boat was the last to be filmed. Or one of the last. Mm-hmm. Um, and with that, it was just, okay, cool. She's missing. Let's just roll with it. Yeah. Because I think the the capture scene of you talking to Brandy or Jordan, mm. that was one of the last scenes. Because and you could tell as the sun's going down. Yeah. Um. It was like cool. And if you notice too, when Lindsay's in the suit, the sun the sun is almost Set, down. Oh, setting, yeah. Because it was like, oh damn, how do we make this make sense? Now, granted, we do a lot more planning with our videos. Now. Yeah. Now we yeah. try to. Yeah. Like I have scripts on scripts on scripts right now, and just, literally it's just getting it done. Yeah. Which is the unfortunate part because everybody we like everybody who's in those movies wants to do more, wants to be in them, but it's just like getting our schedules. Some are halfway across the country, some are halfway across the world, and it's like damn. <laughs> so now we're on that time crunch of five months. We got five months to do whatever. Yeah. Big things. Big things. But yeah, this was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this, and I hope we can make some more because yeah. I really, I, and especially like this thriller, like mm-hmm. puzzle. Not, not really a puzzle, but like figuring things out, you know, like little clues left here and there. Because this was kind of foreshadowing a little bit, like if, if you pay attention to the beginning of the movie, and it's not very deep, it's very kind of surface level. Mm-hmm. But of like him not being able to recall things about Megan or like, yeah. like me being gone and absent, but he was still experiencing things. Things, yeah. Yeah. Plus the shirt. I don't know. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't know. I just I really like that. I like that little thing. Like, well, I mean, what's funny though is that thing is like exactly what you were seeing. Yeah. Um, yeah, we could have done that earlier. No, no, that's okay. Though. No, it's fine. It's no, this is great though. Okay. And that's still going, so that's perfect. Yes. So, uh, anything else you wanted to add? Nah, dude. I, I miss making movies. Yes. It'll happen. Sometime. Sooner or later. Sooner or later. Well, all right, guys. Thank y'all so much for watching. Uh, you know, who knows what's next for Beanie Productions. But thank you guys for all the love support. I'll see you guys next time. Much love. Peace. Have a great rest of your day.